Welcome to the Joy of Music. Featuring the First Lady of the Organ, Diane Bish. We invite you to meet great composers and performers. Travel to Europe's ancient monasteries and snow-covered Alps. Visit great historical cathedrals and beautiful lakes and gardens. Praise ye the Lord. Praise Him with stringed instruments and organs. Praise Him with a psaltery and harp. Praise Him with a trumpet. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. And now, Miss Diane Bish. Welcome to the Joy of Music. Today we bring you a program of compositions of great composers for the organ, as played on some of the world's most famous organs. We begin with Johann Sebastian Bach in a composition performed on an organ on which Bach himself played. The St. Jacobi Church of Hamburg, Germany houses a famous organ built by the German organ builder Arp Schnitger. Having gone through numerous renovations, the organ is still unique in its rich tonal quality, giant casework, and stops which feature the faces of people who help build the organ and raise money for its construction. The foundation of Bach's music was the German chorale. It was on these chorales that Bach wrote his great chorale preludes. His purpose in writing these preludes was to convey a message. The message was usually a scripture text. We hear now his Whither Shall I Flee From Thy Spirit? The running constant 16th notes describe fleeing from God. The melody in the pedal conveys the constancy and solidity of God's Spirit.
Having heard the music of Johann Sebastian Bach, we turn now to the music of Robert Schumann, who was a great admirer of Bach. Schumann was greatly influenced by both Bach's music and Christian faith. Schumann once called Bach that genius who purifies and gives strength, whose music seems written for eternity. It was perhaps through Bach that Schumann became interested in the organ. His sketches for organ contain that beautiful lyricism found in his songs and piano music and are some of the most exquisite pieces ever written for the organ. Charles Marie Vidor was one of the great organist composers of the Romantic period in France. His music is of an orchestral nature and is full of vitality and life. We play the Allegro from his Symphony No. 6 on the four organs of the Freiburg Cathedral in Freiburg, Germany. Here the four individual organs found on four separate walls are playable from one console. It was an engineering feat to place microphones throughout the church, close enough to each organ to record the defined sound, and yet far enough away to capture the simultaneous sound of all organs playing together.
From the sanctuary of Coral Ridge Presbyterian Church in Fort Lauderdale, Florida, we hear now for organ and orchestra the last movement of the Rheinberger Concerto in F. Joseph Rheinberger was a romantic composer for the organ, and his music contains exquisite beauty of both musical line and rich sonority.
We hope that you have enjoyed the program today as we have brought you music of great composers as played on many of the most famous organs and in many of the most famous cathedrals of the world. Oh, praise ye the Lord. Praise Him in His sanctuary. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. Thank you again for joining us, and we look forward to seeing you again next week on The Joy of Music.